Good morning, everybody. We're gonna start today's video with a grocery uh, haul for you guys so I can talk about our meal plan for the week. So if you're not interested in that, I'll put the number on the screen, but I didn't buy enough stuff to do a separate video this week. So let's go over it right now so I can get this put away. All right, so self-explanatory is the milk. Stella drinks milk. Strawberries for all of us, they were really sweet last week and they're always on rollback. Um, so I picked that up. Some eggs. I've been loving hard-boiled eggs lately, but also we eat a lot of French toast. This week I picked up chicken thighs because I want to try and air fry some because that just sounds really tasty. Also, I picked up some little chicken packet stuff that we'll talk about in a minute, but turkey bacon mainly because it's cheap cheaper than regular bacon, but also because you know, it's a little bit healthier for you and then over here just a coincidence, we got a lot of turkey this week. Turkey Franks or turkey hot dogs. Stella likes hot dogs sometimes, so I thought we'd try it out again this week. I got this ground turkey to do kind of like taco salads, taco bowls, or taco lettuce wraps. We'll kind of see how we're feeling when we do make that. Turkey breakfast sausage is Stella's favorite. Speaking of Stella's favorites, we have a bag of chicken nuggets. I'm gonna air fry some Brussels sprouts this week and try and make them crispy and delicious. Bag of cilantro, I eat this on everything. Cucumber for five of this week. Avocado, uh, tomatoes. Those are gonna go into the taco bowls, turkey taco bowls that I'm gonna make or lettuce wraps, or I also got these tomatoes to make lettuce BLTs, so I have mayo in the fridge already. And then we have bacon and tomatoes, and then I guess I could put it on bread too, but I mainly thought I'd do a little wrap thing with it. And then last week I tried this, and I had to buy two more because it was so good. The Trader Joe's lamb vindaloo is like one of my favorite things of all time. It's a frozen meal, but we don't have Trader Joe's here. It's an hour away. So this is the coconut chicken with rice meal kit. So you get a sauce, a seasoning packet, and then some coconut rice. It is so good. So I bought that to go with the chicken here. I also still have some chicken I'm almost done with in the freezer, so that'll probably go in there as well. I already told you about the taco seasoning. I did pick up one of these this week because I just need to stay better hydrated. I have Crohn's disease. I should be drinking way more than I do, and I just figured maybe I will if I got some flavor in there. So this is strawberry watermelon. I already opened it and used it. So if you have any recommendations for other flavors of these that are good, definitely leave them in the comments down below because I need a couple more. And then the last things are also pretty self-explanatory. Stella likes little snacks like this, just little bland things. Cheerios, five will eat those as well. Mini pretzel twists. And then I thought this week I would make mini muffins. And this little thing of blueberry muffin mix was like 86 cents, I wanna say, and you just add milk. So I'm gonna make a tray of mini muffins and maybe freeze those. But yeah, that's everything that I got this week. So our meal plan is going to be coconut chicken curry, uh, taco bowls, BLTs, hot dogs, probably some sort of combination of chicken and Brussels sprouts and, you know, just the stuff here. It is the next day, so I apologize I didn't post a video yesterday, but you guys saw. Yesterday was... Are you okay, sir? Yesterday was like four minutes, and most of it was a grocery haul, which most people don't want to watch anyway. So I figured we'd just continue into today because Stella does have physical therapy this afternoon, and I know you guys like updates from that. But in the meantime, I have to get five out of here because he's getting kind of angry. All right, we're all going to play in Sissy's room because there's toys everywhere and that's like a baby dream, right? So first plan for this morning is laundry, as you guys have seen. I did get a lot of questions in the live stream asking if I still love the washer and dryer thing. I do, I have it linked in the description down below if you wanna check it out if you don't have laundry hookups in an apartment or something, I definitely recommend it. The only thing I wanna say is don't overload it because I tried to overload it this morning and it wouldn't even move like the spinning function. And obviously your clothes aren't gonna get clean that way so i did have to do two loads which sucks okay weird twist to the morning but i decided to go through this massive bag of formal wear that i have that i meant to sell before i moved but then the quarantine happened and people weren't like shopping as much i guess i don't know or maybe i just got lazy and i didn't post them but i've got a turtleneck on right now i don't know how i feel about this dress but it has pockets this video is a dang mess and I apologize that we're jumping all over the place but I tried on formal wear for a little bit and then I got too hot and then Fievel needed to go down for his nap and then Stella had to go down for her nap 
she has therapy at two o'clock today and it's just been like back and forth. I'm still doing laundry in the kitchen, but I'm taking a break now to kind of check in on this video because I do want to get it posted this evening. So also the landscapers are outside the windows because of course they are, because it's like the universe knows that I need my kids to sleep before this appointment. And here they come with the lawnmower. All right, really quick, here we go. I don't even have time to put Stella's shoes on. Hopefully I'll have time before her appointment in the car. I've got a bag of chicken nuggets because we didn't have time to feed her lunch. I just wanted to extend the nap as long as I possibly could, but now we gotta go. Little life hack, not really. All right, lunch is served and we're back. That was kind of a mad dash to therapy, but we did make it on time. In fact, we we're a little bit early as we usually are because as I've said many times before, I like to be early for being early. But Fival is over here, ignore the laundry mess over here. He's having some cucumber to cool down because it is a very, very hot day. I just cut that up and I'm exhausted. And you know what? I'm sitting here starving and I just realized that I haven't eaten today. Like I actually forgot to eat and it is 3.30 p.m. Um, and all I've had is coffee and ice water. So I think I should cook myself something. I'm thinking salmon and Brussels sprouts. <sighs> I don't know. I don't even really feel like anything. Anyone ever get that feeling? We're kind of like, I feel like if there was food in front of me right now, which there isn't, it's just peels. I would eat, but the thought of like actually cooking something, especially in this heat, does not sound appealing. Peeling, get it? Sorry. Did you drop your cucumber? Because I can see it by your meaty little thigh. Yum yums? Let's see if he'll show us his, um, he's got a top tooth now. He's getting the second one still, so it just looks like he has one. Can you see it? I can't tell. There's a cucumber in the way. Where's that tooth? Where's the tooth? Where's your tooth? Oh. Is this mom brain or what? I literally sat down here to tell you guys about how Stella's physical therapy appointment went and I forgot because I was thinking about how hungry I am. And I'm probably gonna forget to eat again between you and I, because I have to get him cleaned up after this and make Stella some dinner. Actually, it's only 3.30, so probably not yet. But anyway, let's talk about PT while it's still on my mind. So the appointment went well. She was a little bit sassier than usual. She did a lot of whining, and the instructor therapist had a hard time getting her to cooperate. But she did walk up an entire flight of stairs, and she walked down it, down it, standing she didn't scoot down on her butt or anything stella's actually never gone up or down a staircase that i'm aware of we've never had stairs or i mean like at my parents house there were stairs but i never let her play on them or anything so this is the first time that she's even attempted a staircase and she did really really well she did get a lot of help and then on the way down we had to teach her how to use the railing and then once she got the hang of it she was walking down with help and support of course but it was awesome to see and that's pretty much what we did for the entire appointment everyone I am sorry for the mess that this video has been if you see like smoke by the way it's not smoke it's the essential oil diffuser and also if you hear Stella yelling just know that it's been that kind of a night so I did just go in there and check on her but it is her bedtime and she's just not having it so after I put the camera away I might run her a bath or something and try and calm her down but she's a little overwhelmed this afternoon I think the physical therapy appointment was just a little too late in the day threw off the naps or something it just it's been a crazy day and I'm sure you guys understand I didn't post a video yesterday and it's just I feel bad about it but I'm also incredibly tired and stressed so I, I'm doing the best that I can posting daily videos but if I miss a couple days this week please forgive me because I'm doing the best I can anyway thank you guys so much for watching and supporting my channel and being my friends and being so sweet and I love you guys and I will see you in the next one